Hey YouTube, Jam Jam and X coming to you today. Thank you for rocking with me. Okay, so what have I been up to? Um, recently I've just been working like a slave. Um, I'm gonna do a separate what's up with me update video, but just know that if you keep up with me like on social media, then you will know that I've been working and then I've been going to school and all this stuff. But I wanted to do like a switch up of videos. I wanted um, to get back to basics. Like I was tweeting the other day how I missed the old me, meaning I missed some things that I used to do, what I used to talk about. And then also it was some things that I just feel as though I want to talk more about and express myself so I want to come out my little shell and I'm going to talk about more things of that so stay tuned for those but anyway today I want to be talking to you all about um, a book club like I used to be in a book club previously I'm not anymore in a book club but I want to do like a book club with you all or like let's talk about some books like what are we reading what are we doing there's so many times that we're on social media and that we get wrapped up and it was like somebody I was watching one here and she was saying like if you're bored 10 things that you can do when you're bored and of course one of the things you could do is surf social media but something that she was saying is that you know stay away from social media for a little bit if that's your last resort is social media um, but like try to read a book write something you know write down your bucket list and you know try to start knocking off those goals and then try to get online and see how you can start knocking off those goals so for me what i told myself what i'm going to start doing i work night shifts now so on my days that i'm off um like i work either three or four days on 12 hour shifts straight and then i'm off for like either three or four days so, with that being said and done, I have a lot of time on my hand if I'm not in school. So, all I do is just sit around and watch the TV. So, I need to stop doing that. And I have so many books. Like, you see that book stand back there? I have those books, but I also I have, like, this bucket of books. And I haven't read some of those. So, like, the end of 2015, I purchased probably about... 10 books and I didn't read them yet and that's terrible like I'm an avid reader and I really need to get back into it so anyway I want to come to you and talk to you about three books I'm planning to read within the next three weeks I want somebody to talk to me about it because nobody like I said people I know y'all I know y'all read books somebody read books out there but it's just it's really hard to talk to people nowadays about books and I'm a nerd, hi. But um, it's a lot of people that's not. So anyway, I want to talk to you about what I do when I read certain books, what books I'm reading, and um, I could talk to you about possibly some upcoming books. So this might be a two-parter. The other books might be after. Probably check that three, four weeks later down the line to see the next three books I'm planning to read. I'm planning to read. All those books that I bought so anyway without further ado I get these together so see these books um first two books I'm reading now okay so a lot of you all seen this this is Devin Franklin and Megan Good the weight now I was super pressed i love them like i really think that they're a really good couple they're very motivational and inspirational and i wanted to, when as soon as i saw this on their instagram i was like let me see what this is about and i immediately pre-ordered the book so because i pre-ordered i was able to um get them to sign it so i thought that was pretty cool and then i have like i put it in the back of this book but I have like all certificate of authenticity. So I put that back in the back. But anyway, so um 
reading this book and I will talk to you in a separate video um why I'm reading this book if you read this book or is reading this book then you have an idea of the video that I'm going to talk about but anyway um I'm reading this book currently um I'm halfway through and I do have an obsession with bookmarkers judge me not but my mom gave me this one and I thought it was absolutely beautiful so you can see it see through and then you know it's saying everything that I am <laughs> so um, I thought that was pretty dope so I put that in here but also something that I do when I try to read like motivational books is um sometimes they'll have in here like they ask you questions and that make you think and they make you wonder or you highlight stuff but in this one since they signed it I didn't want to highlight I know that sounds crazy I didn't want to highlight it but I did take some sticky notes and I have my favorite thing sharpie anybody knows me knows I'm obsessed with sharpies I've said that before but anyway so instead of me um writing in the book I write on the sticky notes and I'll place it where it said so if I want to come back and read it or if I want to talk to somebody about it like maybe I want to talk to you all about it I can talk about it so when I do my other video I'll speak to you all about it and about the sticky notes and hopefully by that time I'll be finished with this book because it doesn't take me long to read especially a book that's only what 245 pages or something like that it doesn't take me that long so um, so I'm reading that. That's actively what I'm reading. Um, now this one, Joyce Meyer by Battlefield of the Mind. I did start reading this and then I stopped. And I think I stopped because this is the point in time I was moving into my current apartment. So my mind got a little bedazzled with other things. So, um, I was going to pick this back up. I didn't forget a lot of the stuff in here. Maybe I might start it over or something, but I was gonna start this back up tomorrow. And let me show you the one on here. This is the bookmark, it's a J, and at the opposite end, it's just a polka dot type of with gold. I told you I'm obsessed with bookmark. What I try to do every time I buy a book, I try to actually um, buy a bookmark. I love bookmarks. I don't know why, but I do. That's the nerd in me. So anyway, yeah, let me know if y'all want to read this. Like these two obviously are biblically based books. So um, yeah, I, the reason why I I got this one, because I don't think I'm going to talk about this in a separate video. But um, one of my girlfriends that's like a mentor to me, um, she was telling me I need to read this because she, said, she was telling me that how I need to renew my thinking and um, think more positive in certain aspects. So, but think of it like in the terms of, um, of the Bible. So it refers back to the Bible on a lot of things. So I was like, yeah, you know, like I said, I, I started reading it and I put it down. So. I need to finish it back up because I love Joyce Myers. She's very motivational. Now, the last one I have not started yet. And when I tell y'all, I cannot wait to get into this book. I'm, I told you, I'm going to be reading all these three books all at once. I'm trying to finish these in three weeks. I have two weeks off from school. So, most definitely, I'm trying to finish, like, um, Devin Franklin, Megan Good book by the end of this week. Today is... Monday going into Tuesday, so I'm really, really trying to finish that by Sunday. And Joyce Meyer, I'm trying to finish that by mid next week or something like that, so I can get into this book. Because when I tell you I love to dig into these type of books, I need it. Lastly, Sister Soldier, A Moment of Silence. This is Midnight Part Three. <gasps> now, I know this just came out not too long ago. And when I tell you I seen it, it came out, I heard the ran to Barnes and Noble, I meant it. This came out January of this year. And this is January 2016. Now I haven't picked it up and read it yet. Um, as you can see, I bought another bookmark. This one is a D. 
to turn around. One of my favorite colors, that's the um, Tiffany blue. And at the back of it is an owl. Um, but, yeah. And I bought I bought the D because y'all probably like, what's the D for? It's because my middle initial is the D. So, sometimes my parents call me by my, my middle name. But anyway, um, yeah, I cannot wait. I read, obviously, the coldest one ever. I read, um, the Porsche Santaga, Sant yeah, Santinga. Why, why can I speak tonight? Santiago. Porsche Santiago. Lord Jesus. I read that book and, um, it was bittersweet. But then also, I was really stuck on the Midnight book, so... Um, when I saw that Midnight 3 came out, I was like, thank God, finally. So, um, I'm a big fan of the Midnight series. So, yeah, let me know if y'all are reading any of these books or have read the books. And let's get a conversation going. And I hope you all, like, read this with me. I think this should be, like, our May book. So, if not, let's do it in June because I want to talk to you about it. So, I'm excited. But anyway, um, my fellow nerds, I hope you all will read with me. I appreciate you. Thank you for rocking out with me. Feel free to follow me on my social media accounts. And I hope to hear from you. Peace and blessings.